my first women's health cover, so I'm really excited. You know, the idea of being a part of a magazine which is, you know, deals with health and fitness, again, a first for me, so I'm really excited. Being fit, for sure, you know, that's what we're talking about today. And, uh, you know, being yourself, being true to who you are, I think. Those are the two things that I think indirectly, even though they're not like directly beauty related, that's it, it kind of uh, reflects. I don't overdo it. I, uh, you know, especially on an everyday basis when I'm not working. I only use maybe a little, you know, coal in the eyes and uh, to go out at night, maybe, you know, a little mascara, but not, I don't uh, use a lot of makeup on a regular basis. I think less is more. So personally, if you ask me, I'd say, you know, keep it toned down, you know, don't, there's no need to overdo anything and shout out for attention. I love food. I'm the biggest foodie you would ever come across. So I, <laughs> there's no uh, dieting or any of that for me. No restrictions in terms of food. In fact, I think it's important to, you know, eat well and to eat what you like. Uh, okay, not necessarily completely unhealthy junk food, but for me, dieting is a definite no-no. And I, I think, you know, those hardcore diets that people go on, you know, where they starve themselves and stuff, I think it's like, I, I'm so anti it. <laughs> I think it's important to be fit, you know, to be active, some kind of basic form of exercise, uh, even if it's something small uh, or something light, maybe not even hardcore weight training, but just, you know, like even a walk every day or you know cardio or whatever so I think it's important to, to maintain a fitness level uh, from the time you know you're young and growing up.